Hey, y'all. Wanted to give you an update of what's going on. I apologize for not having any videos done lately. I've just been super crazy busy. I go to work, I come home from work, and I go do yard work and garden work. And I've already been out there. I'm a hot, sweaty mess now. Cap and all that. Uh, for those of you who follow me on Instagram, uh, y'all know I picked up my order of Zacon 937 beef. Uh, that was Monday night. Uh, Tuesday and Wednesday night, I've been coming home from work and after doing the garden stuff, I have been putting the stuff in food saver bags and patting it out in hamburgers and food saver bags and putting it in the freezer. I've got the first two tubes, chubs, whatever you want to call that stuff, done. I'm taking a break from it tonight because I've got to go wash my potatoes. Uh, I've got to go wash the dirt off my potatoes. They've been sitting up in my spare bedroom and they need, they need to get out of my spare bedroom. Um... I was going to can uh, some of the ground beef Tuesday night, but thankfully I didn't start that project and uh, the Lord was kind of looking out for me on that one because we lost power Tuesday night and I would have been up till probably 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning trying to finish it. So that would not have been fun. Also the reason why I didn't do that was because um, I had gone to the store and bought some of the Better Than Bullion. Because um, I'm planning on using Linda at Linda's Pantry method of canning, by canning the ground beef by cooking it first and then putting the beef broth in there. And she recommended the organic, better than beef, better than bouillon beef broth. Uh, I didn't think about the organic thing. Let me turn you around here right quick and zoom you in. I grabbed just this regular one right here and it does not have the maltodextrin in it that she mentioned uh, and that's supposed to have helped something with I believe with the texture uh, when you can the ground beef that way uh, so yeah the regular one doesn't have it my store both stores I go to had organic chicken better than bouillon but not the beef the closest store to me that carries the organic is 15 miles away, so that'd be a 30 mile round trip. Not gonna happen. So I found something else. I went to looked up on Sam's and they have got this Tones uh, beef base and it contains the maltodextrin. It is also gluten free and has no MSG added, so that's a good thing. There was one other brand I found, and it just so happens I have the chicken uh, broth base in that brand, this Orrington Farm. Uh, but the first ingredient in this puppy is salt. Uh, the first ingredient in Tones is blended, uh, excuse me, <laughs> ingredients are over here, uh, cooked beef seasonings. Yeah, I'd rather have the cooked beef seasonings first than that much salt so and it's no wonder I've not been liking this Orrington farm chicken and no offense to them but okay um, all right also let me get you turn back around here on me um, back up a little bit so I'm like not right in your face I uh, want to give a shout out to a new channel a really nice lady her name is Michelle and she is homemaker on the homestead so y'all please go Check out her channel, subscribe to her, share the love. She has got a wonderful video that she put up. Uh, I believe she loaded it this morning. And somebody's texting me. Uh, loaded it this morning on a peach bunt cake. She had put a picture of that thing on Instagram yesterday and just had my mouth watering. So, uh, please go check her out and tell her Dayla sent you over. And I am going to get back to work. I have still got things to do, but I just wanted to uh, let y'all know about this uh, better than bullion maltodextrous thing. Uh, especially for those who are new to canning or just going in and grabbing the beef bullion want to do this. Uh, you you got to have the organic if you're going to use the better than bullion and get the maltodextrin. Or find something else. Read your ingredients, folks. I know a lot of y'all do that already anyway. Okay, I'm rambling. Y'all have a good evening. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll talk to y'all later. Thanks for watching.